And hello everybody, Zachary5149 here. Um, today's matchup is going to be... Uh... Okay, sorry, hang on, I need to get a few things. I need to get a few things. <laughs> I need to get a few things going. Okay, you just gotta trust me here. You just gotta, you just gotta trust me here. You just gotta, you just gotta trust me here. <laughs> um, Blue Boot Gang versus Christmas Cuties. Um. Uh, give me a second. Hang on. Boo Boo Gang, Christmas Cuties. Uh. Blue Boot. And. Christmas. Hang on. Christmas Cutie. Okay, and on Blue Boot Gang. On Blue Boot Gang, we've got, um... Maggio, and... who else? It's Kellex, right? It's Kellex. Is it Kellex? I feel like it's Kellex. I wanna... I wanna... I, I, I would know. I should know this because I played them. Uh... So, I should know this, but I don't, so, unfortunately. Let me go ahead and just pull up the spreadsheet. Yeah, yeah. Kel X. What? Okay, fine. Maj. Oh my god, I literally cannot, cannot find where this is. Where this is. Okay. No, 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 yes. In Sprecken, in Sprecken, okay, in, Sp in Sprecken, got it. So, M, ah, I, T for the Kabillan air, and then what about Kel X? Okay, you know what? Let's not. Where? Is Kabillanair. Yes, it is Kelly X. Okay, so Kelly X is on. Okay, I got it. 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 It's all set up. It's all set up. So it is. Well, um, let me let me finish this round and then we'll we'll re refigure things out. Okay, so the Kabillanair. Yeah, is on twenty two. 23, 24. Let's reckon and Kalex. Okay. Alright, so if my calculations are correct. Then, uh, the winner of that game was, uh, Blue Boot Gang. Oh? Oh? Blue Boot Gang won the first round? Hang on. Uh, Sugar Cat. Okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. Awesome. Okay, so. Uh, welcome. Sorry, it took so long for the intro. To Sick Layoon's seventh ever block party tournament. We are joined today. With Sugar Cat and Pulse Native. Uh, the match is going to be the Kabillanair and um, Kel X, Kelly X of Team Christmas Cuties going up against uh, Maggio and Insprecken of the uh, Blue Boot Gang. 
Uh, exciting stuff. Very exciting stuff. And with it is located in round four? No, it's round three. Round three of the loser's bracket. Ooh! <laughs> just, just go with it. Just go with it. <laughs> okay. All right. Let's take a look at. Ah! Well, well, what if Blue Boot Gang wins? I don't know. I have. I would have Christmas Cuties winning this match. Uh, even though it's one to zero, Blue Boot Gang right now. That's interesting. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Uh, the winner, it's located in the third round of the loser's bracket. The winner of this game will play Pulsative and Sugar Cat. The loser of this game will sadly be eliminated. Uh, that first game, Maggio, Maggio pulling up the dub, pulling up the dub for, uh, for Team Blue Boot. That was awesome. That was awesome. Good job, Maggio. That was great. That was an awesome performance from you. I'm, I'm so happy for that. Alright, so let's take a look at their average ping rate. So, Insprecken has an average ping of about 20. Uh, Kabilanair, mm, an unhealthy 173. Uh, Kellex, 211, and Maggio. Uh, it's kind of all over the place for Kellex. I'm assuming it's it's basically the same ping as Kabilanair. We'll keep an eye on it, just in case. Because sometimes... You can think that there's uh, a high ping for someone, but it's actually normal. Like Sugar Cat and Bree. Like I, you, I, I would usually think that their pings are not good. Like Bree's average ping rate is like three hundred, three, three plus hundred ping, which is not good in my in my eyes. But no, nah, it's actually fine for her. So and Sugar Cat is the same thing. So cool. Yeah, here we go. So it's round, it's game two, round one of the uh, losers. Uh, well, it's it's mm, it's round three, game two, dash one. There you go. There we go. Perfect. Game, round three of the losers bracket, game two, dash one. It's the first round of the set of the uh, second game of the third round of the losers bracket. I hope that makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I hope that makes sense. If it doesn't, I'm gonna look, look like a complete douche nozzle. Okay. Oh, Kellex on 18. I'm gonna not. I'm gonna not die. Alright, so Kellex died on round 18, if I'm correct. Oh my, lots of people are dying. Oh my, lots of people are dying. Alright, I'm just gonna go over here. Screw it. Oh no, it's that thing that's happening. Oh, it's that thing that's happening. No! <laughs> oh, I died. I think that just happened. Oops. I don't think it matters, but uh, I think it's 2-0 to zero Blue Boot Gang. There was a chance to come back, but I ended up just not... I ended up just not... That just happened. That actually just happened. I just technically scored a point for Blue Boot Gang. Oh my god. So for those of you who do not know what just happened, uh Kel X of Team Blue of a uh, Team Christmas Cutie died. So uh Blue Boot Gang got a few extra points on the board, but then they both fell. Kabilanair and I were the only ones still alive. I was extending the game, allowing Kabilanair to get points. And they, there was a chance to tie it. But I ended up dying too early, I think. So I think it's 2-0 to zero Blue Boot Gang. 
Oh no! Oh no! Oh, I feel so bad. Oh man. Well, it's times like this when you just look at the uh, you look at the rules. Like I brought this up numerous of times. Uh, the technical reason why I round like that is fine. Is that it's up to the player to take advantage, and I. While I agree with that, there's also the fact that the round previous to that was luck-based. I don't know. Well, I mean, it's up to the player to take advantage of that. And even still, I'm ashamed of myself for not SDing. I really should have done it. I'm gonna go ahead and SD on round 21 this time around, if I even make it that far. <sighs> it's not like me to tamper with the game. You know, it should never be about people outside of the game, even if it's just about them being able to take advantage of me. You know, it should never be about me to begin with, but that's what they say, so that's what we're going to go with. So it is 2-0, Blue Boot Gang. Very interesting what is happening right now. 2-0, Blue Boot Gang. Maggio and, uh, and Sprecken. Doing a great job, actually. Doing a great job. They've improved. I'm a, I'm a little nervous. If I ended up having to go against them again, I don't know. I feel a little nervous. I would feel a little nervous. But hey. We beat them 3-0 to zero when, we, when it mattered, so... That's about all I can say. They're a great team. Like, I did, I did not see this coming. I thought Blue Boot Gang was going to be uh, eliminated a lot sooner than they have been, but no, nah, they're they're sticking in there, and I am eating all the crow in the world. I underestimated you, Blue Boot Gang. I apologize for that. I like underestimating people because it gives them because when they when they perform better than I expected them to, it's like it's it's nice because it's just nice. But it's not over yet. Blue Boot Gang still has a chance. I mean, sorry, Christmas Cuties still has a chance, and I really don't want to see either of these teams eliminated, because I have a soft spot for both of these teams. But unfortunately, one of them are going to get eliminated. So, I apologize to both of, your, of you in case. So, good luck. I wish the best for both of you. I'm going to go ahead and I steal a little earlier. That's the thing, though. That I the dilemma I'm facing is that I want to record the scores and I have been recording the scores. It's just I haven't been. Um, it's a lot harder to do so when you're alive and trying to stay alive as well, um, which is why a lot of these refs will SD uh, because it's easier to record the scores when you're not trying to play the game. You're just watching it. So yeah, that's interesting. That is very interesting. I'm going to go ahead and SD so that I can actually have an easier time recording the scores. Here we go. Everybody's alive. Round 20. It should be very... Oh. Oh, is anybody going to go for the middle? Doesn't look like it. Mmm. Alright, another really good Speed 11 map. Let's see what happens. Oh, and it's a corner! Kabillanair is the only survivor! And that is a 43 to 42 finish for Christmas Cuties, keeping the dream alive. How about that? That is an amazing jump. Well, that was a completely skill based, speed 11, really tough jump. That was amazing for, from Kabila Nair, keeping the dream alive. Excellent jump. Very excellent jump. Very impressive. Alright, so we're still going. We're still going. This is, this is turning into a rather interesting affair. Let's just hope this match finishes in the next hour. <laughs> I gotta go and get some... <coughs>
<coughs> I gotta go get food before I go to work today. I'm gonna upload both of my, uh, of the videos, because I haven't uploaded one of the other videos, um, yet from the loser's bracket, so. A 3 to 0 sweep, I think, was the one? What was it? Oh yeah, it was Walking Corpses versus um, Doinkers that I need to upload as well. Yeah, I'm sorry. I haven't found the. It's not. It's not that I. I don't want to. It's that I'm just really lazy. <laughs> I feel really. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm gonna upload both of these videos. It's actually nice because it gives me something to watch while I'm at work. Um, and I'm on my my 30 minute break. I get to just like while I'm. I get to watch these videos. It gives me something to do. <sighs> I'm not closing tonight, so yay. It's 1 o'clock in the afternoon, I work at 3, so we got plenty of time. I'm going to try and upload these videos before 2 o'clock, because if I don't, then it's going to be trouble for me. Well, anyway, just to recap, it is 2 to 1. Uh, uh, Boot Boot Gang is currently in the lead. It was 2 to 0, but Kabillionaire made a fantastic Speed 11 jump on a very difficult map to do on Speed 11. That kept him alive and breathing. But even still, it is match point for Blue Boot Gang. They just gotta pull one more game out of them. And then they will go on to play Walking Corpses, which is Pulsative and Sugar Cats. They can somehow do that. And that's really all they can do at this point. Oh, and. Mm. And. Nothing really to commentate about until it gets to the later rounds, because we all know what's going on here. It's just a game of block party. Like, I could talk about the maps, but this early in, where it's only round 12, or it's speed 6 or something, I don't know what speed it is. It's probably speed 7 or 8. Um, but there's not really much to talk about, because, you know... The pressure is not on yet, because it's easy to do these maps. I say that as somebody immediately dies. <laughs> no, I don't know. I don't know that person. I don't know that person. That one doesn't count. It's only if the four people die, and this map could actually produce some interesting results depending on the color. Nah, or maybe. No, they're all. All four of them are still alive. Right? Yes, all four of them are still alive. Alright, and I'm about to SD, I'll tell ya. Alright, so it's T and K on one team, uh, I and M on the other, so there's that. Alright, last game before I SD. Whee! I'm gonna go ahead and get that raw. Oh, this could be interesting. If anyone going for the middle, M and K. Oh, and it was 20. I'll have to fix that in a minute. Oh, and that's it! That's it! That's it! That's it! It's over. Blue Boot Gang has defeated Christmas Cuties. Oh, wow. I did not see that coming. I'm going to be honest. I did not see that coming. I thought Christmas Cuties could do it. Wow. All right. Well, unfortunately, that is it, so thank you all so much for watching. My name is Zachary5149, and I will see you in the next video. Gonna wait until it's exactly 20 minutes, and...